the probability distribution means that how do we categorize probability? Okay, the first one is called discrete random variable. So why do we call it as discrete random variable? Eh? And then the other one is called as continuous random variable. Okay, so number one, the keywords of random means that um, we hope that our data is all random one. You must remember stats is like one big um, subject where it starts from collecting data and then make tabulated data and then from there you count and do analysis that's why we really hope that everything is in random okay to be fair okay to be fair to make make, make all your survey all your things to be fair okay so that's why they have a words of random okay because randomly arrange the, the letters or whatever okay so what is discrete and continuous there so um if you learn bio or you got take bio or you take science you might heard about inheritance okay you might heard about um might heard about um variations okay so you have heard about um people that uh you have two type of things the first one is the height or weight okay so height or weight is what we call as continuous random variable where your data right is continuously got numbers one like, like for example uh the height of the students in the class it can be 150 cm until 200 cm height and then in, in between you got 151 152 153 or 155.5 or 171.5 okay this is all continuous so they they are very continuous and then one of the another example is your igcse result <coughs> your marks okay you, you you have heard about threshold okay you have heard about oh this year the threshold is very low a lot of people get a star or something like that why what what i mean how do they do that right? because all these things is actually from okay from this thing continuous random variable because students result are starting from zero percent until hundred percent different different marks also you can get okay so therefore your data will be something like that okay and then you have you might heard about bell shape curve bell shape curve means that um uh, most of the uh, most of students will be around in the average and then and then this is like you know uh, a star students the kind of stuff okay this is what i call continuous random variable.